And here we are again for another Magnese moment with Richard Magnese of Magnese Title and Law Firm. Richard, you know, I've been in real estate for probably about 10 years and I practice actually in another state. And there, it was usually attorneys who did our closings. And moving here, it, sometimes it's a title company, sometimes it's a law firm. So I have customers who actually ask me that who come from out of state who don't quite understand that there's title companies who may not have an attorney on staff. Can you kind of give us some insight as to maybe Florida and how that works in Florida? Okay, sure. Well, there, like you said, there are some states that uh, require uh, attorneys to do real estate closings. I mean, real estate is a legal process. There are lots of legal uh, documents that are involved, and contracts, and deeds, and mortgages. And some states, probably because even though I'm an attorney, um, the attorney uh, lobbying group is probably much better in some states than it is in others. <laughs> and, uh, but Florida is not like that. Tennessee, where I started uh, practicing real estate law 32 years ago, was, uh, was a state. When I, when I first started closing real estate loans in 1980 in Tennessee, almost all of them were done by attorneys at that time. And um, when I started closing them in 1980, when I opened my own law firm, I closed as Richard McNeese's attorney, but I could have set up a title company. And then I ended up um, um, forming a title company in 1990 to do closings, but I had a real uh, purpose for that. My purpose was I was hoping one of these days I would have something that I could sell, which I did. And I sold that title company, and when I sold it, that's when I moved down to uh, Florida. In Florida, it's, there are probably more title companies doing closings than there are attorneys. Um, and I could have come to Florida and uh, open up a title company and not be licensed to practice law uh, in Florida. Uh, but because Florida is one of the few states, uh, New York I mean, and uh, Arizona, pick a state that everybody uh, wants to live and you can pretty much rest assured that any professional is going to have to take whatever exam it takes to, to be able to practice their, that particular profession there. And Florida is one of them. So I, I had to make a decision. Do I want to go through, because I swore I would never take another bar exam after one in 1973. Am I going to take the bar exam or not take the bar exam in Florida? Do I want to practice law there or do I just want to have a title company? And I, I elected to go ahead and take the bar exam. And uh, in order to make sure that I did pass it, I told people I was taking the bar exam. So I would never, I never want to admit that I failed it. But there, there are some advantages, in my opinion for a title company to, to be run by an attorney or to people just to go to a closing uh, agent that is a law firm. There are, as I said uh, previously, it's a legal transaction. There are lots of things involved in a, a real estate trans, uh, transaction which could need the eyes and ears of an attorney to look at. Uh, title companies can only prepare documents that are necessary to issue a title insurance policy. If uh, someone is unwise enough not to want to buy title insurance, they can't go to a title company to get it closed, to get the transaction closed. Because you can't do that. You can't close a transaction unless you are an attorney. There are numerous uh, reasons why it's nice to have an attorney that you can talk to. I just had a telephone conversation today with someone involved in a transaction. They were asking for an interpretation of a contract. Title companies can't interpret contracts. Real estate agents can't interpret uh, contracts. Only attorneys can interpret uh, contracts. Uh, if someone is involved in a transaction and there's also a separate transaction for uh, the, the furniture or the furnishings or something else that's being sold as a part of the transaction, title companies can't prepare bills of sale for personal property. They can only prepare documents for the issuance of title insurance. Um, there are Many times where the transaction proceeds not very smoothly, uh, there may be some uh, issues that will come up that require additional um, addendums to the contract that are not available as a form for the realtors to use. Attorneys can only prepare those. Leases that might, uh, let's say that we can't close when we're supposed to. 
and and the, the seller says or the buyer wants to lease the property beforehand or the seller says I have to stay there longer than I thought I was going to but I want to go ahead and close well a, a lease might have to be prepared a te temporary occupancy agreement might need to prepare, be prepared I decided for myself at least that I wasn't going to give less than what I consider to be full service and uh, when I had a title company so I decided to go ahead and get my, my uh, law license and I think I think it has helped me. I know that you guys, you contact me all the time about we do. stuff. And, you know, for nine years we've been good friends. Mm -hmm. And um, our customers have really, really depended on your guidance. There are numerous times that I pick up the phone and call you and say, I need you to interpret this for me. What does it say? Or is the buyer right? Is the seller right? Can you just kind of give us a little bit of guidance so that we can help them in making some decisions? And we appreciate that very much. That's my pleasure. Um, Another thing that we love in closing with you is um, the I cookies. That be. And uh, every time one of our buyers or sellers gets to come here, they get to enjoy cookies, compliments of Magnese title. So uh, this has been another Magnese moment. We appreciate it, Richard. And uh, if you'd like to have a closing with Magnese title, I suggest you call your Paradise Group so we can find that perfect property for you or even sell your property. And uh, you can come here and uh, have a cookie with us. Thank you. I'm not going to do it. <laughs> You're good. <laughs>